Well, sh I recorded an entire episode and I lost it. I lost all the footage somehow and I think it might have been something to do with me going off to Vegas for basically a week and I think I lost the footage sometime during that period but I lost the footage for the video so now I'm going to have to create this incredibly short video here and just bring you guys up to date. I do still have some footage left so I'll play that while I'm talking and basically what we did was built up the rest of the cliffs on this side so they are now basically all complete. Now now, there are still a couple of sections that still need to be done so I can't quite say they're entirely complete but they're basically there so that's incredibly annoying but I guess that's what I get when I don't upload for a couple of months so if we take a look at the completed cliffs here you can see there's a green for scale and if I swing this around without knocking anything off the table you can see it is entirely done and that makes me incredibly happy because we can move on from these cliffs and that also means that not just this side is done but also the other side right over there is done so now we have two completed cliff faces and that feels absolutely amazing and we can start working on the top sections here where all the houses are gonna go and there's a lot of detail that needs to be done up there but I honestly can't wait to do it because it's something different than working on cliffs now I don't think there's too too much more to say on these cliffs other than this back section right over here so you may notice it does potentially look a little bit strange with these flat edges up at the top and bottom but I'll quickly explain what's going on here so obviously this is just the front section so there's also the back section that's gonna be sitting somewhere over here and so I'm going to continue this line of bricks up and like slope it up and like do like a little bit of a cliff face pattern over here and it won't look exactly the same as this over here because the studs are placed just right side up instead of sideways and the reason I'm doing that is because of these really tiny gaps that form. So if we get close to the mock you can see there's this really subtle gap right at the bottom there and in order to not make that very obvious on like the edges here where the rest is basically this nice smooth block I decided to try and level it out as neatly as possible and Annoyingly, the cliff face here that's facing sideways is one block or one stud off of being perfectly in line. So I basically just had to pull off a little trickery at the back. And so you can see that the sideways bricks go up to right here. And then after that, it's just these plates stuck like that. But as you can see, it's just this nice flat wall on the side there. And so basically what that allows me to do is to flushly integrate the cliff face with just the side wall here. And now I know there is still this little section here that isn't quite to the same level so I'll have to build out just a little bit more cliffs on the other side or the other section so that all of it becomes just a nice flat wall and then we don't have to worry about building any more cliffs down on this side. So I do actually quite like how when you step back and look at it it just kind of all slopes up into like a nice flat section so i think that will look cool and that will like continue on for a little while and then we'll just have the strip going up to complete it off and not have any weird jagged lines so i think that will look pretty good I think that basically does it for this episode. I know, super short, but again, I did lose a bunch of footage and we did like a bunch more things and I talked about a bunch of things, but we won't worry about that. We'll just keep it nice and short and I'll get a video actually uploaded to you guys. So thank you for watching and sticking around for this progress update. And I think with that said, Gigahertz Productions, out.